Imagine a world where you plug in your electric car for just five minutes, and when you unplug, it's ready to drive one zero kilometers non-stop. Sounds like a scene straight out of a futuristic sci-fi movie, right? But here's the shocking part. This is not just a dream anymore. This could become a reality much sooner than anyone expected. And leading this revolution is none other than Toyota, the world's most trusted automaker. Recently, Toyota has dropped a bombshell that has shaken not just Japan's auto industry, but the entire global automobile market, the breakthrough of solid state batteries. Now, you may have heard this term thrown around before in research papers, tech talks, or futuristic predictions. But until now, it always felt like something decades away. Well, that's about to change. Toyota claims that its solid state battery technology could be ready for mass production in the near future. What does this mean for you and me? Until now, the biggest concern people had about buying an electric car was simple. Too much charging time and not enough driving range. Nobody likes waiting 30 to 60 minutes just to charge their car, especially when you can fill a gas tank in five minutes. And no one wants to stop every 200 or 300 kilometers on a long road trip to charge again. But with a one zero kilometers range and charging times as low as five minutes, this entire conversation changes overnight. If Toyota really makes this work, then my friends, the age of gasoline and diesel cars could be over. And yes, this would shake even the giants of the EV industry, Tesla, BYD, Volkswagen, Mercedes, and every other automaker in the race. In this video, we're going to break down how Toyota's solid state battery actually works, when it could realistically launch the science behind it, and why it's being called the biggest automobile revolution of the next decade. We'll also look at the challenges and threats Toyota faces in bringing this tech to life, and finally, what it means for you, me, and the entire global auto industry. And before we dive deeper, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss updates like this that could literally decide the future of your next car. Toyota's position in the market, why this matters. Let's step back for a moment and talk about Toyota itself. Why is this such a big deal? For decades, Toyota has been known as one of the largest and most reliable car companies in the world. From the early 90s all the way until today, Toyota has built a reputation for producing vehicles that run forever. If there's any automaker that symbolizes quality, trust, and longevity, it's Toyota. Think of iconic models like the Toyota Corolla, Camry, or SUV legends like the Innova, Highlander, and Fortuna. Millions of drivers swear by them. In fact, some Toyota models are so reliable that they've almost become boring because they just refuse to break down. But here's the twist. While Toyota perfected gasoline and diesel engines and even became a pioneer in hybrid vehicles with the Prius, it has lagged behind when it comes to fully electric vehicles. Toyota versus Tesla and BYD. If we talk about today's EV market, two names dominate. Tesla in America and BYD in China. These companies have been selling millions of electric cars annually. Meanwhile, Toyota has mostly relied on hybrids. By 2023, Toyota had sold about 1.9 million hybrid and electric vehicles, but the vast majority were hybrids. Pure EV sales were still very small compared to Tesla or BYD. Why? Because Toyota believed the world wasn't ready to switch completely to electric all at once. Their strategy was to use hybrids as a bridge technology to slowly move customers toward electric vehicles. And honestly, they weren't wrong. Millions of Prius buyers proved that people wanted fuel efficiency before they were ready for full EVs. But now the game is changing. Global warming, stricter emission rules, rising oil prices, and pressure for green energy are forcing Toyota to go all in on electric. That's where their solid state battery research comes in. Toyota isn't just trying to catch up, it's trying to leapfrog everyone else with a breakthrough that could wipe out EV range anxiety forever. What exactly is a solid state battery? Let's break this down in simple words. Right now, most electric cars use lithium ion batteries, the same type of battery found in your phone, laptop, and even scooters. These batteries work because lithium ions move back and forth between two electrodes, positive and negative. The part that allows these ions to move is called the electrolyte. Here's the problem. In today's lithium ion batteries, the electrolyte is a liquid, and that liquid comes with big drawbacks. It can overheat easily, cause short circuits or even fires. You've probably heard of EV battery fires. And over time, it degrades, reducing battery life. 
and that's why the auto industry is calling this a game changer. What does a one zero kilometers range really mean? This is not just a number, it changes everything about how we think of cars. Right now, most EVs on the market have a range of 300 to 500 kilometers. That's good for city driving, but still stressful for long trips. If you're in the US, going from New York to Chicago or Los Angeles to San Francisco means stopping multiple times to recharge. But imagine an EV with a one zero kilometers range. In the US, you could drive from New York to Detroit or Dallas to Denver without stopping. In Europe, you could go from Paris to Rome or Berlin to Vienna on a single charge. In India, where the average driver travels only 40 to 50 kilometers a day, one charge could last you two to three weeks. That's massive convenience. No more worrying about finding charging stations every other day. Road trips become easy, and for the first time ever, EVs would actually outperform gasoline and diesel cars in range. Think about it. A typical gas car gives you 600 to 800 kilometers per tank. If EVs cross one, zero kilometers, people will start asking, why should I even bother with gas? But how can it charge in just five minutes? This is where things get really interesting. Today, even the best fast charging stations like Tesla superchargers or, meanwhile, Toyota has mostly relied on hybrids. By 2023, Toyota had sold about 1.9 million hybrid and electric vehicles, but the vast majority were hybrids. Pure EV sales were still very small compared to Tesla or BYD. Why? Because Toyota believed the world wasn't ready to switch completely to electric all at once. Their strategy was to use hybrids as a bridge technology to slowly move customers toward electric vehicles. And honestly, they weren't wrong. Millions of Prius buyers proved that people wanted fuel efficiency before they were ready for full EVs. But now the game is changing. Global warming, stricter emission rules, rising oil prices, and pressure for green energy are forcing Toyota to go all in on electric. That's where their solid state battery research comes in. Toyota isn't just trying to catch up, it's trying to leapfrog everyone else with a breakthrough that could wipe out EV range anxiety forever. What exactly is a solid state battery? Let's break this down in simple words. Right now, most electric cars use lithium ion batteries, the same type of battery found in your phone, laptop, and even scooters. These batteries work because lithium ions move back and forth between two electrodes, positive and negative. The part that allows these ions to move is called the electrolyte. Here's the problem. In today's lithium ion batteries, the electrolyte is a liquid and that liquid comes with big drawbacks. It can overheat easily, cause short circuits or even fires. You've probably heard of EV battery fires. And over time, it degrades, reducing battery life. 